And as workers across the world celebrate International Workers' Day, the Lagos State Governor, Babajide Samwolu, has urged Nigerian workers, especially public and private workers in the state, to remain productive and committed to carrying out their duties. Correspondent Love Ikoku Oyedeku now reports. It's a full stadium. Different cater of workers from all sectors in Lagos State trip to the Mobalaji Bank Anthony Stadium to celebrate May Day. The arrival of Governor Babaji De Sawonlu set the turn for the event. As a tradition, the day provides another opportunity for the workers to appraisal and reappraisal the impact of government on their welfare. We commend the Lagos State Government under the leadership of Mr. Governor for prioritizing the welfare of workers at all times, particularly Mr. Governor, sir. We thank you for clearing the backlog of pension payments in the public service. Unstable prices of market commodities are sustained by inflation have shortened our initial euphoria and totally eroded the gain of the minimum wage. Mr. Governor, sir, like the parabolic Oliver Twist, we would like to have a party with you, sir, on the ways to cushion the effect of this adverse economic condition. The union leaders call on someone little quickly address the increased cases of robberies Activate the President order on local government autonomy and ratification and the domestication of the ILO Convention number 190. Many have been raped, robbed of their personal effect while in traffic to walk or back home or brazenly kidnapped. This has been worsened by raging police brutality and extortion arrows, in which some workers have been arrested, detained, and even killed extrajudicially on Trump up charges. This has made the world of work a very difficult place and offered a peep through a narrow window leading to the gigantic call of possible surge of criminality in the country. This must be quickly addressed before spiraling out of control, most especially in Lagos. Good message from the Minister of Labor and Productivity, Chris Ingigi, almost through the workers of GAD. Airports. Dams, flyovers, and other projects across all states of the federation. In addition, the GP per capita. The governor seems to rescue the moment as he moves forward. He commends all the workers in the state for their patience, strength, passion and commitment to the development of Lagos State and Nigeria. Our development agenda is anchored on the existence of a skillful, productive, competitive and adaptive human resource base. To this end, I have also approved that 13 members from the delegation of Lagos, TUC and LLC and the Lagos State Public Service will be going on the annual International Labour Organization course convention in Geneva. Highlights of the day is a traditional march passed by the workers. From Lagos, Love Ikuku Oyedoku, Plus TV News. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.